some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves somewhere out in Georgia with a Moorish soft guard who has been pulled over for no plates. And he ends up encountering a no-nonsense sheriff's deputy who is not going to put up with any of his BS. And I would like to give a shout out to uh, Truth Science for this video. I found it on his channel. And uh, if you have not already subbed, please do so because he specializes in more sovereign citizens. And he is quite good at it. So now, let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. How are you doing, sir? I'm good. The reason I stopped is... Can you I don't have a license plate. Yes, sir. Would you mind, can you roll it down just a little bit? I'm a Moor. Huh? I'm a Moorish American. I'm not a citizen of the United States. I'm Okay, you crayon munching soft tart. You say you're not a citizen of the United States. Well, uh, you are still just as subject to the laws of our country as everybody else that comes onto our soil. Just as you would be subject to the laws of any other country as soon as you set foot onto their soil, you still have to obey their traffic laws. You have still obey their civil laws. You still have to obey every law in their country otherwise they'll prosecute you because once you break their laws you ha are under their jurisdiction now okay i still need a driver's license i don't need a driver's license call your superior please okay. he'll let you know i am the sergeant sir okay okay so i need to see a driver's license i got a court document right court documents that I've been to court for this. We don't need a license. We need anything. And just to let you know, you're on live. That's fine. I'm recording you too. Okay. We don't need a license. My name, Marius Dale Simpson Bay against Aaron Castillo. Here's your case number. This was their case. This is my case in federal court. Al Moroccan Empire Society. Here's the case number. And where's the case? Oh, and there's the docket number. Okay, well try to explain it to me so I understand. There is no need to drive or my bad travel upon the roadways. You can look up Georgia right to travel. Even Georgia's right to travel informs you that you have the right to travel upon the roadways, byways, and taking upon a license is basically surrendering your birthright and your inalienable right to travel upon the roadways. You're basically giving up your right. Yeah, that bill was drafted back in 2010 by some sovereign citizen who managed to infiltrate the uh, Georgia Senate because it sure as hell written like a uh, sovereign citizen uh, drafted it. But anyway, it was never passed. It never made it past any of the votes. So it's not exactly law. So why are you quoting something that didn't exactly get ratified by the Georgia Senate to begin with? I mean, it was dead on arrival. And if any of you want to read this draft, I'll go ahead and leave a link in the description so you can, guys can read it and get a good laugh out of it. I don't. You do have to have a Georgia driver's license. That is not true. That is not a fact. It is, sir. I asked you to call the sheriff. It is correct. I asked you to call the sheriff, and they'll inform you. Well, I don't need to do that when I know what the rights are in this state. You can look up the Georgia right to travel. Just Google the Georgia right to travel on your phone. Well, soft heart, as I mentioned earlier, that was never ratified. So you should not be trying to use it as a defense. But I'll tell you what was ratified. The uh, traffic codes related to failure to display license plates, which is the thing you are violating right now travel or drive a vehicle on the roadway of this state you gotta have a valid driver's license from some state that is not true sir it is true sir that's not the constitution the constitution states that we can travel we have a free right to travel the 13th amendment set me free wait a second i thought you said you weren't a u.s citizen and yet you are trying to use the 13th amendment to your advantage 
So my question is, are you a U.S. citizen or are you not a U.S. citizen? If you are not a U.S. citizen, then you should not be worried about the, any of the amendments. But if you are a U.S. citizen, you should know about the Tenth Amendment, which grants the states the right to create traffic laws, you freaking moron. The Thirteenth Amendment freed me and you. No, sir. That yes, it did. Correct. The Thirteenth Amendment freed me and you. I'm a Moor. Black people don't have a right to travel without a driver's license. I am not black. I don't care what you are, sir. You, I just need a driver's license because you're driving without a license plate. That is not true. I don't need a driver's license plate. I don't need a driver's license. Yes, you do in order to operate a vehicle in this state. I ask you to call your superior, sir. I want to speak to your... Okay. I, I will not drive anywhere. I will not speed up, I will not do nothing. I will stay right here until your superior comes to inform you of the Constitution because you took an oath of the Constitution. I have your oath right here. This is your oath of, of, of what's the name? So you carry around an oath of office in your visor? Uh, yeah, has that ever worked for you? I have your oath. This is your oath right here. I, I have yours. But it's very simple. All I need here, oh, here's the Georgia right to travel. There you go. There's the Georgia right to travel. This is not correct, sir. That is, that's the Georgia right to travel. That is not me. That's House Resolution 1203. Correct, correct. but it still states you have to have a... No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. I can read it to you. I don't need to hear it, sir. Right, right here. Free people have a common law and constitutional right to travel on the road. You do have the right to travel, dumbass. But it is the mode of transportation that is regulated by the states, such as motor vehicles, the which the state of Georgia has laws governing that. In addition, and I know this is now beating a dead horse, but quit using that dead on arrival Senate bill that as an argument because it never passed the voting process, use idiotic sovtard. So let me break this down for you. If it had passed through the legislative process and been enacted into the law, you wouldn't be sitting there arguing with this officer about it because the officer would know about it. Because unlike you, the police department would keep their officers in the know on the current laws so they could adapt to it, you bloody moron. They try to keep their officers educated, unlike you. Let's see how this officer acts. Like you said, you wanted to talk to somebody? I got a lieutenant on the way to talk to you. Thank you. Okay. I appreciate it. No problem. If you could, could you call the sheriff? The sheriff knows the law. We send our documents to all sheriff. We inform them that we're nationals. We're not citizens of the United States. The 14th Amendment was deemed unconstitutional. Oh my goodness. You are a special kind of stupid, aren't you? I just don't know where you get your information from, considering the 14th Amendment was never deemed unconstitutional. It is still on the record books, and it is still active, you bloody moron. Therefore, no, it does matter, though. You are a private, you are a private, let me talk. Oh, no, we do not. No, we do not. Okay. Again, I will inform you of this. I will inform you of this. I'm listening. Am I under arrest? You are being stopped right now. Am I being, hold on, am I being detained? Yes. yes, you are. Okay, that's awesome because I have a, way, a fee wager, uh, waiver on there. So if you detain me unlawfully, unconstitutionally, then therefore you guys are liable for my charges. So present us with your uh, fee schedule. I would love to know what you're charging per minute. 
great. So I appreciate that. You are being detained right now because awesome. you do not have a license plate and you are not providing a driver's license. I don't need a driver's license. It's not required. Can you show me in the Constitution where it's required? Dumbass. You dumbass. You're a dumbass. Such a dumbass. You're an ass. It's in the law books. Separate. That no no no. There are penal codes. There's a there's a okay. difference between right. penal code and the constitution. You must learn the difference. As a constitutionally sworn oath to protect and provide for the nationals and the citizens. They don't have no authority on our land, man. It's us that give them authority by submitting to their stuff. I hope they do smash me out the car so we can sue. The, I'm gonna sue the shit out of their ass too. And your parents have any children that live? Sir, yes, sir. How about they regret that? One. Uh, I ain't going nowhere. I'm not going nowhere. He pulled and another cop pulled in front of me. What is the issue? What's the issue? Okay, so let me get this straight. You refuse to show your license. You refuse to cooperate with the officer on anything. You become belligerent. And you wonder why they call for backup? You are so lame! I'm not trying to, I'm not resisting. I'm not resisting at all. Sir, I'm not resisting. We could talk. I'm okay. coming, to, I'm here to talk. Okay. I'm here, to, I got law right here. Okay. So ain't no need to get violent. Ain't no need to bust my windows. Ain't no need to try to yank me out my car. I have every document that you need. Okay. Dude, you have presented them with nothing. Nothing at all. Case in point, that House resolution that never made it past the Senate floor. Who's connecting the traffic stop? I just need a driver's license, sir. And again, I'm a national. I'm not a citizen of the United States. You have a driver's license. This is my driving card, my traveling card. I'm Senator not driving. I'm not driving. You're, you are I under have, arrest. You're under arrest you're in the car. Under arrest. So here's my. Under arrest, step out of the car. Too late for that. Sir. Step out of the car. You're under arrest. We're going to come in and get you. Yeah. That's it. Um, it's the same thing on the car. All rights are reserved. Even on the car. A R R. All rights reserved. Do you see that? Give me one second. Do you have insurance cord for this vehicle? I don't need none of that. As a national, I don't as a national, sir. Not as a national. I'm a national. I'm not a citizen. More is our wake. We are taking our place on this planet. Insurance on this vehicle. I am not a citizen. Citizens are different. Here, take that as well. Citizens are different. Please read that. There is no need for no forceful action, none. I keep telling you, I got court dockets right here. I've been through this system, I've been through this like multiple times. Listen. Well, I don't doubt that you've been down this road before, but it appears that you have not learned anything from the experience. Listen to me. Do you have insurance on this vehicle? I'm insured. I'm insured. Is the vehicle insured? My name is insured to travel in anything. Okay. Do you I have, have a triple insurance card for I have triple A insurance that's for anything. Okay. Do you have a card showing that? But that doesn't matter. It do, it's not necessary. Okay. It's not even necessary though. You forcefully call like why is everybody European? Why don't why is it not another more here? Why is it not another person that look like me here? Like real talk. All I need is. There is no forceful nothing. Like I don't understand. Like what is the? License. Why are you going through all this? Because it's my right. That's no, my. I'm, look no, at it. Sir. Look at the driver's license. I am a commercial driver. So when I'm in a commercial truck, that's a commercial capacity. The only time you need a driver's license is when you're buying or selling something.
You're wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. Or you're traveling or transporting something. You're not. I'm not doing that. That's the definition of driving license. The definition of travel is I have an inalienable right to travel upon the roadways. I have not needed a driver's license to leave my domain to go nowhere since slavery ended. Well, the video ends right there, folks. And according to Truth Science, the guy was arrested. Too bad the uh, soft hard cut it off right there so we won't be able to enjoy the whole thing. But uh, you know how these sovereign citizens are. They don't want you to see their... Uh, failures. They just want you to uh, see their successes if they ever have any. At any rate, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.